So sometimes when you find you go to clean your instrument, there's a problem. And that problem is that some of the slides are jammed in. And no matter how hard you pull, they won't come out. If that happens, don't try and force them. Just leave them in, and when you go back to school, take it to your instrument teacher, and they will sort it out for you. Some of the slides may move, but others may just be jammed solid. But you still need to clean your instruments, so here's a quick way of doing it. It's not great, but it works. And we use the shower. So, here we go. So to clean our trumpet using the shower, we take the shower head off. Making sure you don't lose the washer because your mum and dad won't be happy. In fact, it's probably best getting your mum and dad to do this for you or with you. So we get our instrument. We hold it over the bath or the shower, whichever you have. And we turn the shower on warm water, not hot. Then we put the shower over the end of the instrument so the water comes out of the end. So we see, we see water coming out the end. Make sure you press the valves down so the water goes into all of the tubing. And just do that for 30 seconds or so. Then switch the shower off. So what you find now is you've got a trumpet full of water. So if I try and blow it, water comes out and you can't make a noise. You have to get rid of the water. So if any of your slides are free, make sure you press the valve down for that slide. Take that slide out under the screw, of course. Take that slide out and let the water out. So you're thinking, how do you get rid of all of the other water out of it? So what we do is, we spin our instrument. We get our instrument and we turn it round. And if we keep spinning it, each time we spin it, a little bit more water will come out. We can also use the water keys and blow. There we are. And quickly, you'll find all of the water is out. How can you check? Put your mouthpiece in, blow, and it shouldn't gurgle. Oh! It's girdling, there's still water in it, so let's spin it again. Making sure you press the valves down as you spin it. Get all that water out. Still some in there. It may take you a while to do it. You can hear it all coming out as you turn. And each time you turn, a little bit more water will come out. There's still some in that third valve. Keep spinning, it will take you a while, but it's worth it. And there we are, all the water's gone. But don't forget to clean your mouthpiece.